Investment in midwives means a commitment to a healthy and wealthy nation. On this day, the 5th of May 2014, it gives me great pleasure to be sharing the message of the International Day of the Midwife. This is a day to recognize the great work that the International Confederation of Midwives and midwives all over the world do, saving the lives of mothers and newborns. Midwives are essential for the prevention, care and rehabilitation of women from the point of pre-pregnancy counselling right through to post-delivery care. Women experience less preterm births, less assisted deliveries and greater satisfaction with care. Through the availability, adaptability and resourcefulness of midwives, our healthcare systems can be strengthened. Approximately 290,000 women and over 3 million infants die each year as a result of pregnancy and childbirth complications. With the equipment and support that they need, midwives can prevent the majority of these deaths. The work of midwives directly contributes to healthy outcomes for mothers and their newborns. This in turn contributes to strong communities and national economies. Evidence shows that midwives are crucial to achieving the Millennium Development Goals or MDGs, especially MDGs 4, 5 and 6. The key issue we face, however, is that there are not enough midwives to reduce maternal mortality by 75% by the year 2015. We look forward to new estimates from the planned launch of the 2014 State of the World's Midwifery Report. However, we know that currently, ensuring universal coverage for maternity care requires at least 350,000 more midwives across the world, particularly in the developing countries of Africa, Asia and South and Central America. In Nigeria, the Wellbeing Foundation Africa has been in collaborations with the Nigeria Primary Healthcare Development Agency since the inception of the now world-famous Midwife Service Scheme. We have been working to ensure that midwives have access to the right resources to carry out their duties and save lives. The Wellbeing Foundation Safe Delivery Kit, which we call a MAMA Kit, contains materials and disposables. This initiative has been much complemented by the provision of personal health record books. This revolutionary document has helped to place all the information about mother and child in one booklet for easy cross-referencing and application for appropriate case-based management of illnesses of both mother and child. This improves communication between healthcare providers, often with life-saving information, making the work of midwives and doctors much safer and easier. Midwifery services are economic and cost-effective, saving millions of lives every year. On this International Day of the Midwife, we must garner investments and contributions from governments, the private sector and the philanthropic community to improve the working conditions of midwives all over the world. This will help ensure access to midwives in the most underserved areas. An investment in midwives means commitment to a healthy and wealthy nation. We must continue to support midwives and enable them to change the world by supporting the well-being of mothers, families and children, one birth at a time. <laughs>